Alright friends, we are back with uh, the Sims 3 Midnight Sun Challenge. So what we're going to do here is um, Allie's going to paint apparently for a little bit. And everyone else is still sleeping. So I'm not <laughs> actually not... Th oh my gosh, I'm having a terrible time trying to talk. Um, no one's really doing anything quite yet. Uh, Coco got woken up, but that's okay. She'll feed her little fishes. And go have some breakfast. We'll have Allie come down here and uh, feed Chip because he is apparently mighty grumpy. No one likes a grumpy Chip. Alright. We hear you, Chip. We hear your pain. Tiny little friend. Stop screaming. Ay, ay, ay. We'll have Allie go use the bathroom. Eat some pancakes. Oh, Coco, what should we do with you? Every time you snorkel, you break it. Um, let's try snorkeling here this time. Seeing if it doesn't work a little bit better. Clean up. Um, eat pancakes. Alright, let's have Allie go spend a little bit of time with Chip. Um, we haven't, haven't done much with him, really. We'll go we'll spend a little quality time with our boy Chip. Oh, this way. Let's bring him upstairs. Put Chip down here. Um, check our plants. We'll tend the garden. Let's see. I can clean up a bit. And our usual fishing. More fishing for you. Go here. And, uh, fish with the jellyfish. Go ahead and sell this ruby that Coco's found, and a toy boat. Um, go ahead and sell all these anchovies. We don't really need her to have all of this. Um, you know, just not necessary. We'll give Mr. Z the alley catfish though, so we can use those. All of this makeup. Alright. Doing pretty good on money, which is a good thing because um, Coco's gonna be a teenager, and once she is a young adult, we'll be sending her off to find herself a man. Um, you guys let me know. It'll be up to you. We went to China with Allie for our first generation. Where do you want Coco to go? So we can either go to Egypt, France, or we can go to China again. So you guys, um, let me know where you want us to go to find Coco a boyfriend and explore a bit. And I will take your consideration <laughs> into consideration yeah yeah because it doesn't really matter to me I don't really care obviously it'd be nice to go somewhere else instead of like China again but I don't care don't care and that'll put us on our third generation once she gets married and have kids and then we only have two more to go which is good because I you know I like this challenge but I feel like it can get pretty old after a while, because there's just not much to do, really. You know, fish, paint, the huge. But yeah, and then once we finish this challenge, 
we'll be um finding another one to do because I definitely want to keep doing some challenges. Not like there's much else to do, you know. All right, well, he's still fishing. Oops, still fishing with the jellyfish. Inspect the water, see what's in here. Um, let's relocate. Let's um let's fish over here with a lobster. See if that gets us anything different. This is a pretty painting. I think we'll keep this one. Um she does have a painting still in her inventory, so let's go ahead and see what this is. It's a blowfish. Um sure, we'll keep that on the wall. Nice to have a little bit of art around the house, you know? We'll keep this and eventually put this in Kogo's room, maybe. I like this painting, so we'll take it. And have her start on another one. Alright. Well, did he catch a shark? Lovely. All right, Coco, um, let's have you let's see if boating maybe helps. Uh, let's try going here and seeing if she doesn't get stuck through the floor. Ooh, unlock the saltwater fishmonger achievement. Yay, achievements. So, uh... Yeah, so we caught an anchovy jellyfish, tuna, clownfish, and swordfish. Awesome. So go here, Coco. Please don't get stuck. I don't think she's... I don't think Coco's working very well. Um, it's from here. I don't know, guys. This world seems really buggy. Teleport me here. Okie dokie. Well, Coco's stuck in the ocean, so we get to reset her yet again. I don't know what to do about that. It's really, really aggravating. Alright. Um, go play peekaboo with your brother, I suppose. Just almost done with this painting. Oh, that's very cute. It's a fairy and a butterfly. We'll sell it though. I don't really... I don't really have a purpose for that one. Use the bathroom. Eat some food. Um... Let's not do that, Coco. Let's just watch some TV. Put some clothes on first and then watch some TV. Alright. I'm gonna feed this guy. This little guy. Oh boy. We have broken the bathroom. Broken the bathroom. Alright, feed chip. Clean up a bit. Let's have you eat some dinner as well. Use the bathroom. Um, Coco can go to bed. You can do whatever, because I don't care. Alright, let's uh, snuggle. Change diaper. And put in crib. Have him come out here and fish a little bit more. Hmm. 
Hmm. Maybe we'll just try fishing with the angelfish anyway, even though we can't see it. Um, let's try it and see if it works, you know? See if we catch any. Can certainly try. Right, so let's try fishing with the angelfish and seeing what we get. We're catching a tuna. Looks like we're not getting any death fish here. Let's try over here. Nope. Nothing, guys. No death fish here. That's so annoying. It said on the forum post, the guy who made this, that there were still death fish. Bothered. I am bothered. Well, go to bed. We'll sell some fishies while we're waiting. Alright, let's get rid of a bunch of these swordfish. No one needs that many. Like, ever. Don't know why you'd ever need that many swordfish. Trying to keep the best quality ones we have to use for bait, obviously. Hmm, okay. So she's awake, she's just gonna do her thing. You can get rid of most of these angelfish, I suppose, since there's no death fish in this world. And I can't figure out how to put them in the world. So, we don't need them anymore. Um, what else? We've got clownfish we can get rid of. Lobsters. Doing this challenge always makes me want to go out for seafood every time. Just all looks so good. It's Coco's birthday. Fantastic. I don't know why it says these are store-bought. Maybe they were. I can't imagine how they would be. Um, whatever. Not relevant. Keep selling some starfish. And, um, anchovies. These books away. Doing a little spring cleaning here. <laughs> um, alrighty. Oops. Miss clicking all over the place. Oh! We're not gonna make it, I think he's gonna pee himself. That's okay. We'll see if we can get there on time. Probably not. Come on, come on. Come on. Watch up here. Go, go, go! Can't we make it in time? Use body chair. Eee! Oh yeah, we made it. Look at that. Alright. What's she doing up here? Tending the garden she is now. I'm eating. Alright. We 
should probably feed Chip, huh? It's Coco's birthday. This is so exciting. I can't wait to see what she looks like as a teenager and give her a makeover. It will be fantastic. So I think we'll buy her a cake, actually. Yeah, it is her birthday and all, so... Let's go ahead and buy a cake. And once... Once Mr. Z wakes up, we'll give her a little, little makeover. Alright, use the bathroom. Alright, you've slept long enough. I want to see Coco grow up. So let's do it. The time has come. Chip, why are you screaming? Whatever, we don't have time for your nonsense. Oh, she's gonna blow out her candles looking like that? Come on. Come on. Go, 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 go! Alright, let's see. See what she looks like here. Chip's just picking his nose in the background. As you do. Alright, Coco has reached her teen years. So, due to her indifferent study habits, Coco has been given the clumsy trait. Oh, she is just the cutest. I mean, look at her. Is that not the most adorable little pink-haired child you've ever seen? I mean, I think she's adorable. She's so cute! Oh, yay! I am very pleased. Very pleased. Coco might be like the only child I've ever had in Sims history that has been like pretty darn good looking mm. and she's totally Allie's child I mean they're like little twins perfect alright so you don't need any cake because you just ate so let's go ahead and um oh you know what we don't have a mirror so Ah, uh, screw it. We'll just take her into create a sim, and I'm gonna save really quick though, because I don't want anything crashing. That would be a nightmare. And then we'll give Coco a makeover. Come on, come on. Alright, so let's go into create a sim, and change her clothes, and give her a new hairstyle. She's uh, been rocking that one since she was a toddler. No, this is a different one. Still cute though. Alright. Still got those purple eyes. Love it. Okay, let's find a hairstyle. Hopefully my create a sim loads pretty quick. Looks like it's going to. Um, let's see. Don't want any of that nonsense. Yeah. Yeah. It's kind of boring. Kind of boring. This is Coco we're talking about here. We need something fabulous. I'm gonna change those roots too. They look. Oof. They look yucky. Um. <laughs> I'm so indecisive, you guys. This is gonna take forever, probably. I'm sorry. So sorry. Um, let's see. Oh yeah, we got new um into the future hairstyles we could do, but those look a little weird. I'm not gonna take forever, I promise. I promise. Oh, that's pretty. I like how it um splits up the pink and the blue. Very nice. 
Yeah. Hmm. That looks very weird. Let's see here. Hmm. All right, what I think I'm going to do is I am going to um, go ahead and cut out and redo her makeover, and then I'll be right back. All right, so here we have her um, everyday wear. I left her hair the way she aged up with. It's from uh, Master Suite, I think. She just, I think she looks great with her hair up. Nothing else quite looked the same, and I, you know, I like the little hair bow and stuff. It's, it's kind of her thing. So I gave her this outfit from um, some expansion pack, I don't remember, and some flippy floppies. For formal wear, which doesn't really matter, but I changed it anyway, I gave her this dress from Anubis Under the Sun, and some sandals. Is that? And we've got your sleepwear, nothing special there. Athletic wear, I left it with what she was in because it just, it looked fine to me. Castle. Got a scuba scoot, scuba scoot, <laughs> a scuba suit for somewhere since she is um, doing a lot of snorkeling. And then for outerwear, which again we rarely need, I just gave her a hoodie and that? some jeans. So that's all we're changing. Um, didn't change her appearance or anything like that. And with that guys, I'm going to go ahead and end this part. Good news is Chip will be aging up in the next part, so we won't have a whiny little child around the house anymore, at least for a little bit. So yeah, um, that'll be all guys. Again, let me know where you want Coco to go as far as World Adventure Worlds to find herself a man. And uh, yeah, see you guys next time. Bye.